Hello and welcome to my personal edition of Hawaiian Shirt Friday Technology with Dave from PowerMation. I am David Ellers, Business Development Manager here at PowerMation for the Phoenix Contact product line. And normally I deal with the automation products, but today I'm going to do a little something special on some of the tools. We all use sensors, actuators, cables, wires, and we all need tools to um, deal with them. So on a standard sensor actuator cable, whether it's gray or it's yellow, eventually we need to cut and strip and peel back the wires. This one you can see has been peeled back quite a bunch. And Phoenix Contact has a lot of great products for that. So I have a great pair of cable cutters here, so I can come in and just snip this off in a hurry if I'm in a glance. Uh, great for copper conductors. If I need to crimp these wires and I have some ferrules, this is an excellent V-groove ferrule cutter. And uh, the V-groove on this is set, so it'll take a variety of ferrule sizes. I just slide it in on the end and snap. We also have a version of this, I don't have it here today, that is available in what they call a dual mount, so I can rotate the head and either come at it vertically or horizontally. So side mount or front entry mount on the tool. Pretty handy to have if you're using ferrules on your panels. But today what I want to talk about is how do I get this jacket off of this cable? And we've all seen the time, or we've all done the time, where we've gone out, taken our pocket knife, opened it up, and tried to peel that back, and then you realize you cut the conductors, and it's all messed up. Or you blood of your thumb. We've all been there. Or maybe you use a, a tool like this. This is great for cable conductors. I come in, clip on the cable, spin it around. It'll slice that in. There's a adapter uh, adjuster here, so I can adjust the blade depth on my tool and get exactly the conductor head I need. This is really big for bigger conductor cables than this multi-conductor cable. So for multi-conductor, what Phoenix offers is their SAC, their Wirefox SAC, which stands for Sensor Actuator Cable. There's two versions. There's one for the really thin um, M8 connectors with those super thin wires on them, and this is the standard size connector. So if I slide this out of the package, I end up with a simple tool that's marked for wire depth of the strip, and it's pretty simple to operate. I just line up my cable, shove it down the throat of the tool, and if I want a longer strip, I can shove it right all the way down the center. It's a pass-through, and then I crimp on the wire. So if I come to the other camera here to do that, nice and close, bring it in, grab it, snip, pull it back, and leaves it on just like that. And as I did that rather quickly, I'll give you another snap without all the buds. So very quickly, Take the cable, slide it in, take it to the depth I want, measuring here. Simple crimp, and there's your cable stripped to the length you need. Very quick, very easy, and available from PowerMation, and this is the Wirefox-SAC. Thanks for joining me. See you again soon.